At Inuyama's funeral, Tinibu urged to release Kanu. Good morning, everyone, and thank you for tuning in and listening to this headline that we got in here this morning. As our headline for this morning says here yeah, that at Inuyama's funeral, Tinibu urged to release Kanu. Different speakers of Igbo extraction yesterday at the service of songs of the late President General of the Igbo Chief Emmanuel Inuyama demanded the immediate release of leader of the indigenous people of Brafia, IPOB, Mazin and Bikanu, from detention. They lamented that the release of Kanu was Iwunyamu's last assignment, urging President Bola Tinibu to grant Iwunyamu his last wish. The Igbos, the Igbo leaders further urged the federal government to immolarize the late Onayade leader, noting that he was a nationalist. Similarly, speaking at Iwunyamu's line in, in, in state of an old Eastern Nigeria government lodge in Enugu, Governor Peter Umba described the deceased as an Iroko and a bridge builder who fostered unity at troubled times. His words, he possessed remarkable work ethnics and left a profound impression on me. He was a trailblazer on the media, sports, industry, engineering and aviation. He was indeed ahead of his time. On his part, former governor of Ebony State, Dr. Sam Egu, said Iwunyamu was a great man. Former President General of Anaisi Indigbo, Chief Gary Iguariwe, described Iwunyamu as a man who believed in Igbo land and was great in every sense of greatness. He said, We crave the hydrogens of that to ask Mr. President to please heed the call and release Mazi in Amikanu. Secretary General of Organizing the Igbo Ambassador Uke Emushi recalled that the deceased never failed to tell his Brafian story and civil war sojourn. Wife of the first president of Nigeria, Professor Uchi Azikwe, pleaded with the federal government to immunize um, Imunyangu. In the same vein, President General and founder of um, Mumadra Igbo Nigeria and Dispora, Lolo Kate Ezeofo, says, President General and founder of the Umada Ibu, Nigeria and Diaspora, Lord of Kit, said, May God bless President Bolatin Ibu. You oblige us with the immunization of Chief Doctor Emmanuel Unyamu and release and release of Inandikani from DSS custody. And that is all we are, uh, that is all we have for you guys concerning this headline today this morning. We said say that at Inunyamu's funeral, Tinibu is urged to release Inandi Kanu. And what of course, yes, you had it for me this morning. And if you're not a subscriber, the best you can do right here, right now, is to tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, leave a like on the video to get more updates concerning this in the nearest future to come. Tinibu is urged to release in Amikanu. Well, this is not the first time your president has been urged to do that. But at this time, in even in Onaze, in the former Onaze Indigo president, Iwun Yangu, which Tinibu was supposed to attend. They urged him because they said they said it that um Iwun Yangu's last uh, mission, like his last thing he wanted to do before he died, was to secure it was, was to make sure that Inamikanu is being released. Is being released. Like we all know that when Iwun Yangu was I was alive, he was advocating for the release of Inamikanu. He was telling him that she released Inamikanu. Don't look at that or that side, look at the insecurity that is causing the Southeast. Just take a look at that. Like he was telling Tinibu things that needed to be done in order to um, stop the insecurity problem from the southeast, and one of that is to also release in Amikanu. And now, at the burial of in, at the funeral of in, uh, this man, the Igbo cleric have said that Tinibu can't just grant this man his last wish because his last wish, if you could remember, was t was advocating for the release of Inamdikanu. Yes, then everybody came with one accord, still telling the president to release the, the um, IPB leader in Amdikanu. Yeah, they tend to release in Amikanu. Even um, Peter Umba said the same thing. He said that this man was a nationalist. Like he, he, he has brought a lot of development to the South East. He's a voice that everybody respects. That just please grant him his last wish. They're not. They're not. They're not more asking for themselves. They're asking for him who have died. Because even Tinubu respects him. Everybody respects him. So they're not more asking for 
release in Abikan because they want to, they, they are, because they want Tinubu to release in Abikan. You know, they are asking Tinubu to do that because it will be the right thing for you to do to a fellow nationalist who died. At least granting him his last wish. So I think you guys understand it now, and I really hope that this president, too, who is very very stubborn, will listen. Because at, at, at this point in time, Bayo Nanuga never say anything. Tinubu himself never say anything. Yes, Bayo Nanuga have not said anything. Tinubu himself hasn't said anything concerning it. But looking at the comment section um, that, that I have here, Oish Kashi Ugo said that, Thank you all of Ufa Mo Ibo for being your brother's keepers. You see, Ibo people, they, they look at one another. They look for out for one another. Just look at this now. This person is saying thank you all the Igbo clerics for being your brother's keeper. Oduduwa did it for Sunday Igbo. In Amikani will not be an exception. May Yahweh bless our leader. Amen. Um, Lagos Abuja said that who is this Inunyan self? No wonder the, the devil is black. Some p stupid people will still say stupid things in the comment comment section. Um, Prince Joshua says that um, I'm yet to know the real person why an Amikani issue can't be addressed. The real people troubling this nation are working freely. The Nigerian government is holding Namdekano. Is it because he's Igbo? Okay. Okay. We know that the Nigerian government did not release him. Yes, because of his name is Igbo man. But what do you guys think? Drop a comment in the comment section. Don't forget to leave a like on this video. Then tap the subscribe button as big video with the notification bell. So that anytime I have any new video, you will be the first to get notified about it. Once again, thank you for tuning in. And ask and have a wonderful day ahead of you.